Do you have problems with uh, your right hand technique, especially playing rhythms? Well, this is the video for you. My name's Nigel Clark and this is GMI. <laughs> The problem with, uh, for some people uh, is they think that the, the left hand is everything on the guitar. In fact, the most difficult the most, and generally where problems start to creep into your playing are, can be with your right hand, obviously if you're a right-handed player. If you're a left-handed player, then think the mirror image of this. So the crucial thing is with the, with the right hand is that you have to be relaxed at all times. Now that's might sound a bit too simple to say but everybody knows how to strum very uh, the chords you started out with a G chord the way folk musicians do but what I'm here to tell you is that you actually need to keep how relaxed you sounded with those kind of chords throughout your entire life of playing it doesn't matter how complicated you get you have to retain that simplicity and that relaxed feeling in your right hand. So I'm talking about when you play lines and particularly in this video when you play rhythm. So if you want to play like a kind of funk rhythm, for example, this is obviously not really a funk guitar, but a guitar is a guitar. So if you wanted to play um, something like uh, Prince might have played. I'll do that again. If you want to play something in the way that Prince might have played, this is one of his little uh, kind of riffs. Now you're never going to be able to play that unless you have this real relaxed thing going on with your with your right hand. Your position is very important. You need to be poised above the strings, but crucially. Uh, you need to just keep that very relaxed. Your elbow not moving, but your wrist, the action is there and it's just totally a relaxed feeling. Okay, so that's generally the rule for uh, rhythm playing but it also applies and this is something that not many people know to playing lines especially playing lines at speed if you're using this, the technique that I enjoy using which is alternate picking so for example going back to that A minor chord and playing and starting on the F sharp on the D string and just playing those six notes the feeling in the right hand is exactly the same as when you play you you're not using as much movement obviously because you don't need to With that but the the feeling the relaxed approach in the right hand is exactly the same as that and what I found, have found that, uh, that I do instinctively is lean into the strings in the same way that you for a, for a funk pattern when you play the line you can lean into the strings in exactly the same way on a smaller scale Okay, I hope you find that interesting and useful. Um, if you're watching this on YouTube, please do subscribe. Uh, the next video is going to be about playing through chord changes.